Hi everyone, this is part 44 to our Around the World requests, as we've been showing the same evidences all around the world showing the end of days coming and mapping out exactly how it will all go. Today we're going to take a look at Monterrey, Mexico here. The part that we're going to show today is with south as north. Now, we've been showing on several of our different hieroglyphs we've broken down around the world that like right here is what's known as the little horn of the Bible. And they come and they do the RFID chip and they have a new type of Eucharist where it will blend the reptiles and the humans together. You can see this woman putting this snake in this child and she's sitting on top of a coffin like death and the Bible it says if you take this your soul is lost. This is a test to see if you have faith for Jesus because if you don't take this you have to go to this guy with the scythe this beast with two horns as a lamb but speaks, speaks as a dragon and he has this scythe you will have to have your head cut off but this means you will go and be with Jesus Christ and because you showed your faith now so all of that's right in there we're going to show that over here today right here in Monterey all of that now the Catholic Church and the papacy the Jesuits have Russia the bear ready to rise up for all of this because the USA is betrayed and sneak attacked and then the little horn rises up with the red side of the world Russia China North Korea Islam all coming well right here you can see this big snake right there easily now they show that a rabbit an awful lot and this rabbit represents the trickster the deceiver like a coyote right here is this rabbit and do you see how the top has the DNA interweaved this is when the two sides are blended together to create the abominations there's the rabbit and then we have the snake right here now right below there you can actually see where they're doing putting these into the head of a person as the mark of a beast basically you can see this entity right here which has a visor on I've shown that they're going to do something to the eyes to make everybody worship the image all the time something like Google Google glasses but this is like the bear or even like an ape showing like that virus of the 12 monkeys we've shown coming right here now a lot of the preachers and a lot of, lot of the people around the world doing theories want to make everybody at the end of the age the same well right here let's show this here this is Jesus putting everybody on top of this person here representing the head wound coming and when the heel is bruised this is a nuclear event coming the betrayal and everybody goes to get on this eagle with this woman that looks like a dog represents the dog star Sirius God has created all of the universe and there's a purpose and a job for all celestial things these are the raptured souls and then these people on this side have to lose their head see the head coming off all when this big stone falls as we're going to show now this is where it shows they're different see the people right over here this is Jesus inside of here he is passing down his mantle to that beast as I've been trying to tell everybody all of this is supposed to happen even the bad side of the Bible so here comes that beast to go off and deceive the world people are forgetting that the new world order and the great deception coming is actually brought by Jesus Christ to test the world it's 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 going to be hell on earth come to him now now as I keep showing most of the churches make everybody the same well the Bible's not like that it's it's natural for humanity to to want to dumb the Bible down these people on top are the dead that rise and the raptured souls not everybody is raptured if you read your Bible it's very clear that only a very few are actually raptured the merciful 
are raptured. The ones that believe in Jesus Christ are raptured. The ones that believe in works and condemn and accuse people, they go to here. The top people are the raptured and the dead that rise. They receive like a, like a dog, like a sheep. They are a prince of peace, a king. They are in heaven, finished. This group, the lukewarm Christians, has to go, and you see how this has no head? They have to lose their head to prove themselves, and Jesus will give them a rod and a staff and a throne and a crown, and they will work with Jesus Christ for a thousand years and rule with him. And then they will ascend to be with all of us. We go to the temple. We are going to the temple of God, and nobody will see us again until the temple comes down from heaven. This is all in the first three pages of the book of Revelation about the seven churches. Now the earth is rebirthed with the woman pouring out the water. And it's all done. Everybody's rebirthed. But you have a difference here. Raptured and the dead rise and a tribulation saint. <clears throat> when you take this mark of the beast, see this here? When you take this mark of the beast, let's show something here quickly. The old legend is, and we're going to show this today too, that if you go across the rainbow bridge into heaven, you get your pot of gold and you receive a great Dane. Well, this is what they're stealing from everybody. Our connection to the dog star Sirius. See the woman over here like a dog? They take our connection to the dog star Sirius away. If you take this mark of the beast, you lose your Great Dane. Right here in his mouth, his Great Dane is falling out. Right there. So you can see this Great Dane is falling out. It falls right out of his mouth. And he loses his Great Dane. He can't go to heaven. He has no way. He has no connection now to the dog star Sirius. See right here? She's right here, right by the eagle. If you don't have your connection to the dog star Sirius, you have no wings. You can't ascend. So they are stealing this dog, just like the Wizard of Oz, as I keep showing, when the Wicked Witch tries to steal her dog. So if he takes the mark of the beast, this dog is spit out. And he is now just a beast, and he can never ascend. All of that right there perfect for us, showing the DNA being interweaved. Let's do this quickly back. And then we're going to go deeper into the nose here. You can see the rabbit with the DNA intermingled. You can see the snake. You can see the beast being created. And now you can see the dog being spit out. He loses his Great Dane. It's spit out into a cup, basically right here. As they, just as we showed in Washington. Remember those who have followed us we showed in Washington? They put a snake in your head and they took the dog out. And then you have no more connection to these celestial realms into the stars. So let's go in closer right into here and show some more things. So let's take this off and go right in here. Let's take the rabbit off. See that rabbit? You can see the snake. You can see the beast. And you can really see this Great Dane right here. So let's go right in here for a second. Let's show all of the New World Order coming again. Remember as we had shown about Finn, this guy rising up. 
the little horn. He is right here. Right there. And he actually has a gun to do the mark of the beast with. Now let's show right here. Remember as I showed like that ship that's coming, like the bull. Here it is, right here. Remember we showed him coming like a shark and it looked like a ship with this little symbol on it. I even broke down a video that has this with little talks of monsters and men. They showed this ship coming right here. This one. This lands down near San Diego and the San Onofre power plant. See this ship? And the red rope of Rahab is cut. That's the rapture. We go up and over the rainbow bridge. Just like here. See the rainbow? And you get your great dame. You are a shepherd, a prince of peace, a king. And then this guy gets up to take peace from the world. This is the raptured people, and these are all the rest going to the Great Tribulation. Oops, we wanted to go to right here. See the ship with the bull symbol? And even the windows make the down near the San Onofre power plant area at the 33 degree parallel in San Diego. Right where this lands. It's all meant to happen. And at that time is when this stone falls. It could even be just a nuclear event. See the stone? Bam! At the same time of this ship. This is the great head wound. Now the devil has been cast to earth and his little way to get around has been destroyed. And now he is loose, free upon the earth. Right here. See the thing right there? Into the ship. Perfect. And then the little horn gets up. Right here. And you can even see his gun. And now he has like that little Eucharist we've talked about too. He has the gun and the Eucharist to give out. And he begins to make the beast, as they talk about in Revelation 13, with the body of a leopard and the feet of a bear. He makes this. This beast right here. See the bear and see the leopard with the visor? And then they have the chip. See the chip right down into the bear. The beast coming. So you have Finn doing the mark of the beast right here and creating the new beast that's coming. It, it, this has been shown all around the world over and over again the same way. We don't know the time or date. That even makes it more perfect. So all of that right there, just as we've been showing. Again, we have verified all of our breakdowns of our different hieroglyphs from all around the world. Finn, right there. See the sword, the great sword coming? There's the great sword. All right there. Well, there's one more part to a beast right here, so let's show that. This is the beast right here, all finished. Right here. This is the beast that has the mark of the beast in its head. They've done things to his eyes. He has teeth of iron and claws and is ready to go off and ravage the earth. Just as in scripture. Finn. The beast coming. Making his abominations. Well, we've shown this stuff all around the earth, everybody. Good job. You can even see the Eucharist coming down as it's coming down from heaven, 
just as in Daniel 8, right here where it says that. Confess with your mouth the Lord is Jesus. Believe in your heart God hath risen him from the dead, and you'll be saved. Hallelujah. Thank you very much, everybody. This is real and all around us. Please keep putting your suggestions in the comments part, and I will get to that section of the world eventually. We learn new things each time. Here is the ship, exactly as we showed in Australia, that this came through the wormhole as the same time as the rapture went through the wormhole when Jesus Christ took his people. And we've shown that all around the world that most of the Christians in the churches just are not reading the Bible, and they are putting everybody in one group. The tribulation saints are not the same as the dead that rise or the raptured. A tribulation saint has a different job. It is all in the Bible, and unfortunately, most of the world has just been dumbing it down. This is the dead that rise and the raptured. They go to heaven. They become a prince of peace and a king. They receive a, like a sheep. They are a shepherd. All those that go and get their heads cut off, the lukewarm virgins, become tribulation saints. And they receive a rod and a throne. And they rule with Jesus for a thousand years. These ones are in heaven. These ones go to a job because they were lukewarm and they had to prove themselves. They basically have to go to work with Jesus. And if they take the mark of the beast, they will never get to heaven. They will be cast into hell. So this is still considered saved. They are going to get to work with Jesus Christ. But there is a difference in the Bible. And, and help your preachers. Read your Bibles. The preachers need help. They do not have all the answers. They are just a regular person trying to save souls, as all of us are. So there that is, right there. Just like in that video of Monsters and Men, Little Talks. Let's show that quickly. This is a video called Of Monsters and Men, Little Talks. And it shows that ship coming right here. You can actually see the ship with the bullhorns. And at the same time, this stone falls at exactly the same time, all through there. In this one, the little horn got up after this crashed, just as right here. We can see the ship. There's the ship. There's the stone. This is by the San Onofre power plant, the two domes. And then we have Finn getting up to do the mark of the beast. He has the gun, and now he has this as the little Eucharist we keep showing. He has that new Eucharist and the RFID chip, and he goes off to make his beasts with the body of a leopard and the feet of a bear, all perfect with scripture. Thank you very much, everybody. Hallelujah. The evidence has been verified all around the world. We don't know the date or time, but everything's being answered.